What's up, y'all? What's up, y'all? About to call. Eating lunch. About to call these ADBA people. What's up? What's up? Good afternoon, everybody. Good afternoon, everybody. Good afternoon. Hold on, let me put my um, Bluetooth in my ear. Yo, I gotta get a new phone. About to do that shit. I might do that shit tomorrow. Might do that shit tomorrow. What's up, big dog? How y'all? Hold on, let me see. This man is sweet. This man calls... I'm talking, yo. I tell all these people to drop their address, man. And I will pull up. Real fact. Hold on. I'll call these. That nigga calls me private every day. Every day, bro. He's a gay dude, bro. Press one. For all Gazette inquiries, advertising, or to order merchandise, press two. Show department, press three. Registration and all other inquiries, press four. If you need to do these all. One moment, please. This is Adam. How can I help you? Yes, Adam, how you doing, sir? Good. Okay. I have a um a UKC American Pipo Terrier, right? Mm-hmm. Can I register with y'all? You can. Um, there is there's a, a chance that we may need to reclassify it as American Bully just based upon, you know, the pedigree of the dog. Mm-hmm. So that's something. Um, probably the easiest way is to send it all. You can send us photocopies of the UKC paperwork um, through email, and we can look at the pedigree and, and see if it would need to go bully or not. You know, if it's coming off a lot of, like, razor's, razor's edge dogs, then, uh-huh. you know. It's, a go- good, it's uh, golf, though. Golf. at it um you know and we'd look at photos of the dog as well and then we'd have to you know make a, a determination based upon the pedigree and the photos uh-huh um yeah. so y'all do do that too based on um photos and stuff like that right that's good right yeah, yeah. it's a, yeah. it's a 90 pound blue dog though yeah see um our, our standard for the american pitbull terrier doesn't usually go any higher than 70 pounds um so mm-hmm. That would give me a little idea that yeah, we may we most likely would need to reclassify it. Okay, and um, is it blue? Blue, y'all, y'all, y'all do blue colors and tri colors yeah, and stuff. Yeah, no, it's, it's not about blue. Definitely not about the color. Mm-hmm. Um, it's all about the structure of the dog and the size of the dog. You know, 90s a lot bigger than than they should be. Um, mm-hmm. And then it, it's bloodline. So we like there are some golf dogs that that we've reclassified and. Typically, they're, they're, they've been bred to the razor's edge stuff. Okay. But I never saw no blue um, pit bull before. <laughs> that's got to be razor. That's got to be. What bloodlines you have that is blue? Um, I mean, there's, I can't tell you the specific bloodlines, mm. but, you know, I, I see them all the time. Yeah, that, that's that razor edge and Gotti. 
really. No, if it, if it has that, we reclassify them because that we've we've determined those to be uh, American bully bloodlines. Okay, you classify that. Okay, um, so that golf is blue. Also, how about that gray line? Um, those are typically reclassified as American bully as well. Okay, um, how about the whopper? Uh, those are those have actually been reclassified as working pit bulldog. <laughs> so they are classified as working pit bulldogs. Mm. Correct. Yeah, and, and it was basically the same thing, but a different bloodline. They were they were uh, breeding them um, extremely large for weight pull competition, and um, you know, same with American bullies. We saw that they were so far away from the uh, the heritage American pit bull terrier breed type. We had to reclassify them as well. Mm hmm. Okay, that's good. Right. Um, all right. Do y'all register um, staff also? Yeah, if they come from the American Kennel Club as American Staffordshire Terrier, we register them with us as American Staffordshire Terrier. Mm -hmm. So they're a different breed as well. They are. Okay. Yeah. yeah that's all I want to know. Yeah. Yeah. Thank okay, you. Well, Thank you for um, keeping it separate. We appreciate you. Yeah. Yes. Thanks so much. Thank you. Bye. ADBA is doing a little bit right and they doing a little bit wrong, but they still got that chart that is wrong. Serious. It's because of me. It's because of me. <laughs> and I bet you it's because of me. But you can't see it's fucked up. Serious. Now, what you said about your question? Yeah, ADB ain't all that bad, but I think it's because of me talking about it and shit right there, but there's no such thing as blue. Yo, he couldn't tell me the bloodlines of the blue dogs. He couldn't tell me that shit. Yeah, UKC is worse than the ADBA. Yes, it is. Real facts. UKC is worse than them, but UK, ADBA is still a little bit worse also. Real facts. No, the blue is not pit bull. That's, that's where they're wrong at right there. They wrong. They are wrong right there. Yo, who wanted a question? I didn't see the question. That's what it is, a blue Paul Terrier. It's a bully. Or a stab or a blue pole terrier or a band dog. You see what they registering? Yo, you see what they American pit bulldog. That's another thing they be messing up too. That's another thing I can't stand. Yo, somebody had a question, man. I'm sorry, I didn't couldn't read your question because I was on the phone talking to the ADBA. But yo, yeah, that's the best team right there. But yo, um, let me tell you something. The American Pit Bulldog, that is the, they should call that shit American Band Doggy. They should be calling that shit American Band Doggy. Real facts. Not Pit Bulldog, because it's, yo, that's the American Pit Bull Terrier. That's a short way of saying that. We called them Pit Bulldogs back in the days also. Excuse me. Yes. What's, what's the best way to tell an exotic bully from a clean bully? Shit. The feet? The feet is, yo, yo, I saw an exotic bully one day. 
The feet was crazy. Master of all bulldogs. But yo, yo, I saw they feet turn up like this. I saw a dog's feet turned up like this, bro. Like that. Turned up. The feet, yo, the whole toes and everything was turned up like that. And it was walking retarded. It was walking retarded. Yeah, it comes that with that kink tails. Kink tails, yes. Kink tails, bro. Serious. I should have asked him about the Hulk. Would you, yo, I got, I got a bloodline of a Hulk. <laughs> See if he will register that. Or Gemini Kennels. But I'm glad they're reclassifying dogs. Because, yo, I put that in there. Hey, I told, I told Patty over there, stop bullshitting with these dogs, man. You see what she doing? And, yo, a lot of UKC dogs are AKC American Staffordshire Terrier. Like that, like that uh, website I showed y'all before, a lot of them. What's up, bro? Yo, but a lot of them, I see 80%. Hell no, I wouldn't, I wouldn't even, I hate, I hate that registry. But yo, listen, a lot of these people, right, that has that UKC, they took that AKC papers and changed it to the UKC as American Pitbull Terrier. Real facts. That's what they doing. That is what they doing also. That shit is sad also, bro. And and ADBA is taking a lot of staff and reclassifying them as um, American bullies. That's what they doing also. Yo, you don't yo, you don't need ADBA, bro. You don't need ADBA, bro. You need this one right here. See that? That's what you need right there. That's what you need. Forget the ADBA, forget the ABKC, forget yo. This is what the ones you need right here. This is this is right here. We reclassify dogs the right way right here. This is what you need. Yo, Papers don't make the dog, bro. Yo, the dog makes the dog. Real facts. This is this is what you need right here, bro. This is what you need right here, right here. This is what you need right here, bro. Right here. That's what you need. Right there, bro. This is what you need right here, bro. This is what you need right here. This is what you need right there. Right there. That's what you need. You need the O-R-E-B-A, bro. Let me tell you something. You see this right here, bro? This right here. This is my favorite right here. This one. You see this right here, right? You see where it says non-breeding, right? If you want to sell a dog, if you want to sell a dog, right, that you don't want breeding that person to breed, this is what you get on the papers. So when you sell a dog and you tell them, yo, you want a spaded and neutered dog, you you give them this right here. You see this right here? The O-R-E-B-A right here. The, the O-R-E-B-A, man. Y'all need to start registering your dogs the right way, man. Yo, I will register Blue Paul Terriers. I will register Blue Lacey. I will register... Band doggies and band dogs, real facts, because I know the difference. I know the difference. Information, the email is O-R-E-B-A, clubs at AOL.com, O-R-E-B-A, clubs at AOL.com. You see this right here, right? Yo, these people, right, they don't understand this, man. You see this, right? It says non-breeding. That means the dog is not suitable to breed. 
So they can't take this shit nowhere else and register their dog. Nowhere else. If you got one of these, bro, you and then you get a contract. See, let me tell you something. You got to have a contract, right? You got to get it notarized, right? You got to get the contract. You got to give these people. When you sell dogs, right? When you sell dogs and they not um, up to the standard of each breed, they shouldn't be bred. It should be selective, a pup, selective dog, selective, selective into that standard. That's what's up, bro. But, yo, you got to get, think about it, right? If you understand this, right, each breed should, yo, be selective before it's bred. And it should be tested before it's bred. To breed true, yes, yes, I, I, I'm with you on that, bro. Serious, and yo, these these people is not doing that. They just breeding just for the love of money. They just breeding for the just the love of anything. They do not do a selective breeding. They don't care. Like example, exotic bullies, right? There's so much wrong with them dogs. They just keep breeding them. They they don't care how the feet looks. Yo, they could look like gremlins. They could look like all kinds of shit. Real facts. But you know another thing. These fucking registries don't put the um the picture of the dog on on the on the certificate and on the yeah, we register all types, bro. But yo, they don't put the um the picture on on, on this. They can't breathe, yes. They can't breathe naturally, shit like that. But, yo, they do not put the picture on the pedigree and on the um, the birth certificate. This is what this is, a birth certificate. This is what this is, a birth certificate. They don't put that shit on there. So, yo, ADBA, right, or U, um, UKC, you think you cannot sell them papers? You think you cannot sell them papers, that pedigree and that family tree to somebody for, for 10 grand or something like that, yo. Oh, and he's now he's registering with the UKC or the ADBA. Think about this, bro. This is how they, they this is the art of tagging papers. And that's this is what they do. Another art of fucking tagging papers. Yo, another art. They will say to UKC and ADBA, right, on paper, they'll say they have 10 puppies. They will say they have 10 puppies, and they really have five. So the other five certificates they get from the ADBA or the um, UKC, what they doing with them? They selling the form. They selling it. Think about this. That's another game I saw in the world. Bro, you could you could buy fucking papers, dead dog papers and shit. That's how stupid these people are. They sell it. Yo, this is how stupid and dishonest this fucking America is and all over the world. Dishonest people in this world, bro. There's too much dishonest people. Too much in this game. Be careful. I don't understand. Cut it, cuffle. Yeah, yeah, be careful, bro. Be really careful. There's a lot of dishonest people, man, in this game, bro. A lot. A lot. Be careful with this shit, man. All I'm trying to do is be honest to everybody in this world, man. The dog makes the papers. Real facts both ways, bro. To me, the dog don't make the paper. It doesn't. It don't mean what papers you got. It's the dog, cause bona fide, right? Bona fide. I don't trust bona fide, right? I can't stand it. I hate it with a passion. I think, yo, if I ever catch somebody um, giving me a hang paper dog, I'm gonna, I'm gonna get at him. I'm sorry. I'm going to get at him. Real facts. 
I don't know what y'all gonna do, but yo, I know I'm gonna get at him. I just can't stand liars. I hate a liar. I can't stand, yo, I hate liars, man. I hate that shit with a passion, man. You selling me a dog and you lied to me? I think you, you a bogus ass fucking scam artist. Like these people be calling me about um, dumb shit. Yo, want to scare me over my social security? Yo, give me my, give me you your social. You have a um, social security problem. It is a cop out. It's bullshit. Real facts. It's one of the bullshitest shit in the world. Excuse my French, but yo, you got to be eighteen and over to watch these videos, cause I keep it a hundred, man. Real facts. I'm from the streets. <laughs> Real facts. But yo. Yeah, they just after, they are not after the standards of each breed. They don't care about the standards. They, yo, it's like five different fucking ways of American bully. What, bro? True that. But yo, listen, there's five different ways of American bully, right? Five. Bro, most of these people got, they breeding staff. Let me tell you something. I'm going to explain something to you, right? They breeding staff to um, band doggies, right? This is another thing that ADBA don't do, right? This is ADBA, right? That's ADBA, right? That's ADBA, right? This right here, this um, A-V-A-N-T, apostrophe S, Rita, that's a staff. That's, that's a staff, right? That's a staff bloodline. I did I did a lot of research about that right there. That's a staff bloodline, right? Let me tell you something, man. There's a lot of fucking staffs, right? That they calling them pit bulls also. The ADBA, the UKC. There's a lot of staff. There's a lot of band dogs. There's all type. Yo, these people crossing band dogs to staffs and then calling them pit bulls. That's what they doing. Yeah, York is a staff too. That York dogs are staff too. But she's crossing pits into a, just like the um, the Tonka, Tonka dogs are stabs also. That Tonka kennel, that's not no um hundred percent Sorrels dogs. Them them dogs is not Sorrels at all. What has been around? What the American has not been around. 50 years. Yeah, you right about that. Yeah, you right. You right. You actually right about that. But yo, listen. Let me tell you something. There's a lot of staffs, people claiming they pit bulls. You got to watch out for that too. A lot of staffs, people are claiming they are pit bulls. What's up, bro? How you doing? Appreciate you watching. Do y'all know that? There's a lot of staffs, AKC staffs and Staffy Bull Terriers that they claiming they are pit bulls, American pit bull terriers. Yo, the two, yo, there's, there's a couple of things that I do not like with the ADBA. That American pit bulldog, it should be American band doggy. Master. That's what it should be. It should be American band dog master. That's what it should be. Not American pit bulldog. That's one classified. They messing up right there. That's one. Then there's another classified with these blue dogs, right? These blue and that tricolor. That dog, they they, they got on a, a um, pit bull chart. 
them dogs is not pit bulls. And then and then this this red, this red tricolor. You got this red. What? Wait a minute. I didn't see that. Damn. Hold on. The new channel, but what blood blood is behind yours? Oh, what's behind mine? That razor edge. And that Gotti, that's behind mine. But yo, listen, let me tell you, the new channel, I don't understand. What are you talking about? The new channel. I, I really don't understand that. But yo, and and staff. Staff, all types of stuff is in my, my breed. My American Staffordshire Terrier. It's a Winston dog, bro. I made my own sauce. Like anybody else can make their own sauce. You got to take somebody else's sauce to make your own sauce. Simple as that. Your own ingredients. It's like taking chicken noodle soup and putting beef in it, putting lamb in it. Now it's your own recipe. Think about that, bro. So listen. All right. That staff, right? American staff is shot terrier. Staff, yo, they, these people got American Staffordshire Terrier mixes, um, um, Staffy Bull Terrier mixes, Band Doggies mixes, and they call it them fucking American Pit Bull Terrier or American Pit Bulldog. I think they need to really change that shit to American Band Doggy. Any dog that weighs from 90 and up and 70 and up and 80. But listen, the staff, right? The staff is 80 to 90. The staff is 80 to 90. See, this is another thing, man. They, they, these people don't follow the standards. It does look different, but they cross it. Oh, what's up? Oh, I know. What's up, man? Appreciate you coming, bro. Appreciate you coming. But yo, listen. Let me tell you something, right? That stab, right? Is the American Staffordshire Terrier and the Staffy Bull Terrier totally different dogs? Just like the American Pit Bull Terrier. Just like the American Bully. Just like the Band Doggy and the Band Dog. All different dogs. All different breeds. And that's real facts. They all in temperament and size and everything. No, okay, see, you got the band dogs and you got the, what's up, man? You got the band doggies. There's two different breeds. Two different breeds. Okay, the band dog, right? Sauce, ingredients is game bred pit bull to any type of master. That's a band dog. And then you line breed and inbreed that. And I mean line breeding, inbreed like this. I'm talking about taking a, a father game bred pit bull and breed it to a, a master, right? Any type of master. Then taking two pups out of that, right? Then taking the father again and breed it to a different type of master and taking two pups with that. And then you take them two pups, right? From different mothers, but the same father and breed them together. You understand what I'm saying? That's a band dog. Now, a band doggy, right, is American Staffordshire Terrier, American Bulldog, American um, Rockweller, or any anything else, right, et cetera, et cetera, right, cross to any type of master. That's a band doggy. You understand what I'm saying? That's the source of that. Every... Breed has ingredients. Every breed has a mixture. Every breed has a shit. A big Victoria mutt. What? What do you mean? All dogs was mutts, bro. American pit bull terriers was mutts. From line breeding and inbreeding makes a purebred dog. Do you know that? You don't get that though. Do you understand that? All dogs was mutts. All dogs was made by somebody, some human. Kobe made pit bulls. Lightning 
made pit bulls. They was all mutts, bro. We need, no shit. When you line breed and inbreed and keep line breeding and inbreeding, it comes a purebred dog. You know that? You, you don't get that, though. I know you, you don't understand that, though. You really don't understand that. I understand it's hard to, to you know, think past one, but all dogs was mutts. From line breeding and inbreeding, you can make your own breed. Do you understand that? From line breeding and inbreeding, you can make your own dogs. They was mutts. So so if you breed a pit to a master, it's a no game bred pit bull with a with papers and pedigree. The pit bull got to have a family tree. The master got to have a family tree. The standards of a band dog is there. The band doggy, the standards is there also, bro. You can make your own breed, bro. Real facts. A mutt. As a dog doesn't have no papers, no pedigree, and you get it from the streets, that's a mutt. It, or it runs in the street, and it's a street dog. That's a mutt. True that, but you got the line breed and inbreed to make it pure. You got the line breed and inbreed to make it pure. And then you got to outcross again because you keep... You can't keep line breeding and inbreeding. You got to outcross also. People don't know that also. You have to outcross. Yep, shoot that. Shoot that. But y'all got to understand this. Band doggy, right? And band dog, right? It's a breed. Then a breed. Hold on, bro. Let me see. Do you got papers and pedigree? Do you got a family tree of your dog? Do you got a family tree of your dog? It's a nice dog, bro. That's a nice dog. Look like American bullies, bro. That's what it looks like. Brindle American bullies. That's what it looks like. That's what it looks like. But yo, y'all have a nice day, people. Everything is not everything, bro. And start your own bloodline. Start your own breed. Start your own dog, man. Make your own sauce. Real facts. What's the bloodline, bro? What's the bloodline? That's not a pit bull, bro. For what? For you stop promoting other people's shit. Promote your own shit. Promote your own breed. Real facts. That's what's up. That's what you like. I like all dogs. I don't like one breed. I don't like one breed at all. I like pit bulls. I like the American pit bull terriers. I got them. Jeep, Red Boy, Jocko, Turtle Buster, Niggerino, Macho Buck. Macho beast, but I'm tired of promoting they dogs. Real facts. That's a lie. That's what you think. That's what you think in your head, bro. There's some dogs that would destroy a pit bull. Real facts. You can also. That's what you that's what you want. I don't want only pit bulls, bro. Because pit bull is like a fucking, like selling crack. Bro, they will try to fucking railroad you for a lying ass case because you got pit bulls. Do you understand that shit? They will try to railroad you for a lying case and kill all your dogs. They will destroy you and put you on a lying case. Yo, you can have a treadmill. You can have a spring pole. They could say you training to fight them dogs. 
Think about that shit too. So I don't just don't want American pit bull terriers in my yard. I don't want that. I have that on their own yard away from me and everything. Five acres. Pitbulls is like dope. Real facts. Pitbulls is like dope. They will fucking railroad you for a lying case and set you up. They will come with mics and motherfucking... Yo, they will come with mics and shit like that. They will railroad you for a lying case for having a game-bred pit bull. And that's real facts. So what you saying, bro? What you saying? Animal cruelty is a felony now. Do you understand that? They think, yo, they think having a dog on a chain is a animal cruelty. But real pit bulls should be on fucking chains. Real pit bulls should be on chains. Do you understand that? Real pit bulls should be on chains. People don't understand that. And real pit bulls shouldn't be given to the public. They should be not given to the public at all. And that's real facts. Real pit bulls should be on chains and they shouldn't be given to the public because these people can't handle the fucking gameness of a pit bull. Yo, pit bulls will kill your fucking yard. They will destroy shit. Real pit bulls. You got these fake ass wannabe staff crosses and these American bullies and these band doggies acting like pit bulls, but they really ain't pit bulls. But real fucking game bred pit bulls, they shouldn't be given to the public. That people is not, don't know how to do that shit. Kennels? Man, that a, 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 a real pit bull will jump out of that kennel to jump into another kennel to grab another dog. I saw it done. I saw it done. Real facts. You gotta have a top over the kennel. You gotta have a, you gotta have cement on the bottom. Yo, you can't have chain links. You chain links is the garbage shit in the world. Chain links. I would never have a chain link ever again. When I when I fix my kennel, when I fucking do it the backyard like how I want it, yo, I would never buy a chain link. If they gave it to me, chain links is the garbages fucking kennels in the world. Chain links. Chain links is trash. Don't buy them. They're not good. Real, real fact. Yo, they should be cut off to the public. Yo, real facts. Game bred pit bulls shouldn't be sold to people that don't know what the breed is, man. Real facts, man. Yo, that breed will destroy shit. It's like a Tasmanian devil. That's like the padded Dale Terrier. That's that's why I keep that private stock. That's why, yo, that's why my shit is closed to the public. Because they will railroad you for a lying case. They will set you up. Yo, they will fucking lie and lie about you. Real facts. I love working breeds also, bro. I love all working breeds. Real facts. I love them all. But that fucking game bred pit bull, bro. It, it's a different, it's a different breed. I love that Kita also. Man, I keep it a hundred in everything I do, bro. Keep it one thousand. Sorry, forget a hundred. I keep it one thousand. It's a destroyer. That's what a real pit bull is. It's a goddamn destroyer. It's like a Tasmanian. It's like my padded Dale Terriers. Them niggas do not play, bro. Yo, them Kobe's is, I, I don't even, 
I don't see too many of them Kobe's, man. Them, I don't see too many game bred Kobe dogs. Real facts. I don't see too many game bred Kobe dogs. Period. And that's real facts. That's real facts. I don't see them being wrong. I don't see them being grand champions. I don't see them none of that shit, man. I ain't see the Kobe Rom in years. I ain't seen one. That blood, I, I wouldn't even get. And I like Kobe dogs. <laughs> I got two of them now, and I be trying to make them game. Real facts. And that's another thing. All dogs is taught to be what he's supposed to be. It's like a boxer, bro. Yeah, I, I know the guy that bred that dog, man. He made his own pincher. He's in Long Island. In Wonkonkoma. Yes. Yes, it, it has. Yeah. But, yo, you got to understand this. What you said? Do you? That's a good bloodline. That honey bunch is crazy too. Yes, they did. A red boy is the best, man. But you gotta you gotta cross it with a, a good hard mouth dog. With a bolio dog or Eli dog. That red boy, you gotta cross it with to a bolio. Or Eli. Real facts. And that's real facts. You gotta you gotta cross that to a Eli or a Bodio. Got to. Some must, that red boy. That's real facts. And dogs need to be trained, bro. You gotta sit there and train them. You gotta put them on a treadmill. You gotta run them. You got to put them on a spring post. You got to do a whole lot to get that dog, the greatest dog in the world. That's a, that's a, that's a fucking fire cross right there. Real facts. Fire cross. But yo, these people, the ADBA, they think there's blue pit bulls. It's crazy. Eli and Lightning. I hear you. That's what's up. Eli and Lightning. That's what's up. Lightner. Sorry. Lightner. Lightning. But yo, y'all have a blessed day. That's a lie. That grand champion, Opie, bro. That bloodline, bro. That Gates. Shit. That Gates with that pit stop kennels. Man, I remember Ricky, bro. Ricky has some great fucking fire dogs, man. And we used to cop from Ricky uh, pit stop kennels. We used to cop a lot of dogs from pit stop kennels, bro. A lot of dogs. We used to buy dogs from Ricky like crazy. You ever heard of pit stop kennels? Man, that motherfucker has some pit stops. Series. I don't like that blood, bro. Real fact. I don't even like that Midnight Cowboy shit. That shit. I don't even like that shit. That Japanese Tosa is great dogs also. Real facts. But y'all y'all have a blessed day, man. Appreciate y'all watching, man. Yo, for my haters, punch y'all self in your face. Punch y'all, no, punch y'all own self in your face, man. We going back to the old videos, you know. Punch y'all, yo, nah, I lick my dogs um crap when they taking a shit. Real facts, man. Yo, after that, for my haters, man. I appreciate y'all, man. Love, love, man. Mucho corazón to all my, my peoples. Mucho corazón to all my haters, man. Mad love to y'all no matter what. No matter what, man. We ride till we die, man. See y'all later.